And hello to you from Molyneux here in the English West Midlands. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers, and they face Luton Town. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And possession lost, intercepted. The initial 11 for Wolves. Pablo Sarabia starts with Daniel Podence out wide. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Can he find the net? Lemina. Decent position for Wolves to be in. A wonderful intervention. Morris. Adebayo. And using his body to good effect. Pablo Sarabia getting forward can he give them the lead oh dealt with by the goalkeeper and there's the delivery An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Oh, great attacking play. There is the goal, and you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper, and now they've really paid the price. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Marvellous Nakamba. Carlton Morris. In the right place to cut out the pass. Here's Traore. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Being pressed hard. Carlton Morris. Clark. Still behind, but the pressure mounting, and a goal kick is the outcome. <laughs> Matt Doherty. And on the ball, Sarabia. Cunha superbly read and executed Lockyer Kelly Ruddick and Fanzu oh and a perfect ball now how about this well good defending clattered out of there well the story of the first half has been written it is half time now here at Molyneux this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a... So back underway here into the second half.
Hodens. Crossing possibilities. An alert intervention. Cunha. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. No problems for the keeper. And into the last 30 minutes now. Promising sequence. Seemed to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Tom Lockyer. Adebayo. And a strong tackle. Plenty of forward momentum here. But can they produce? Oh, great play. Real chance. Keeper getting the touch. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one, but they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Well, it's one pass after another. Lemina. Wonderful chance. As you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Morris determined defending just 10 minutes remaining here and a fine tackle We might very well have late excitement here. Five minutes to go, and just one goal between them. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. And a chance to whip it in here. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And he saw the situation developing. And that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome as far as the visitors are concerned. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.